WebSafe is a new innovation brought to you by Project NOAA, designed to keep you informed and prepared for impending disasters. WebSafe is an impact scenario tool available in the new version of the NOAA website. It produces hazard impact scenario maps, which provides visualization on the possible extent of a disaster and its impact to the populace. This information will be very useful in crafting policies and putting in place the preparedness measures for disaster planning, preparedness, and response by local disaster officers, decision makers in the community, and the national government. WebSafe will provide quantified information such as the possible estimate of population affected by disasters. Also, WebSafe can calculate the amount of basic needs such as water, rice, family kits, and toiletries. On the home page of the NOAA website, click the WebSafe icon on the top of the sidebar menu. As you click the icon, options for impact scenario maps with understandable instructions will appear. Impact scenario maps for hazards, risks, and exposure are available to aptly address your preference. An understandable visualization of the impact scenario of an area and the estimated number of buildings and other points of interest which will be affected by a certain hazard can also be calculated. To know the impact scenario of possible buildings which will be affected by floods, a user can click the building footprints and WebSafe will show a summary of the number of buildings and the flood level corresponding to it. WebSafe can also calculate the number of evacuees in an area affected by disaster. and translate this information into the estimated amount of relief goods needed and its variations. WebSafe is a user-friendly tool adapted from Indonesia's InnaSafe and collaborated with World Bank and customized to the Filipino needs. It's a continuous effort from Project NOAA and the Department of Science and Technology to build a culture of safety and awareness and a sense of preparedness in the consciousness of every Filipino.